Every night, our entire city lights up as thousands of street lights are turned on, bringing visibility and safety to our neighborhoods. However, providing this vital service may soon cost taxpayers a lot less thanks to a new pilot program. Well, today we're announcing a, uh, a pilot partnership with Southern California Edison uh, and City Light and Power, uh, people who take care of our street lights in the city. Actually, they operate and maintain them. And our goal is to help determine the feasibility of replacing the present high-pressure sodium lights that you'll see on this street uh, with uh, LEDs or light-emitting di diode lights. LED street lights offer greater energy efficiency. They, they save about 40 to 50 percent um, off the energy bill uh, from the high-pressure sodium lights that they're replacing, and they last longer. Working in partnership with City Light and Power and Southern California Edison, 130 new LED fixtures have been installed in the neighborhoods of Alamitos Beach, Stafford Square, West Long Beach near Silverado Park, and Park Estates in the 3rd District. Both the fixtures and the installation were provided free of charge to the city as part of this pilot program. Uh, we installed these streetlights for Edison. They provided them. We put them up and uh, made sure that they were operational. Lasting longer and requiring less maintenance, it is expected that the operational cost will translate into measurable savings for our city. Yeah, well look, the more money we save, the more money you can put into things like parks, libraries, police and fire. So it's critical to save money. Now while both energy and cost savings will be tracked monthly, Local residents have also been asked to participate in the pilot program by taking part in a survey to determine the impacts on visibility and safety. If you're in the neighborhood and you do see this at night, you like it, let everybody know because this is going to be the barometer that we use whether or not to tell Edison to go ahead. It'll make the neighborhoods uh, look safer because they're brighter and it makes people feel safer and they will be coming out participating more. Final results of the survey will help our city continue building a brighter, safer Long Beach. To learn more, visit the city's website directly at longbeach.gov.